Hi there, my name's Andy Hillier, and today's guitar lesson is gonna be on Hold Me Like a Grudge by Fallout Boy. It's a cool track. I'm gonna teach you the whole song, but just before I do, if you wouldn't mind subscribing to my channel, it really does help me out. It's Andy Hillier. Give me a like on the video, press the notifications, uh, and I read every one of those comments, so please leave me some comments in the comment section. Uh, and if you love what I'm doing, you wanna support me, support the channel, and you wanna print the tabs off for this, then I'll put them on my Patreon page. I'll leave a link to that in the description. My guitar is in standard tuning. Now the song starts with a bass part, but then it starts playing it on the guitar as well, so we can play it at the same time. So it goes like this. So to play that, open E string four times. Make them short, don't let them keep going. Keep them short going. Dun, dun. And then E5 twice, then E, E5, and then E7 twice. So it goes. So slowly up to there, we've got. Then you've got A5 and A7. So the whole line goes. Bit faster. And up speed. So that just repeats around the whole of the verse until we get this little bridge, which goes. So to play that, open E and A2, so E power chord. Last for four beats, so it goes one, two, three, four. Into the next bar, we've got an A power chord, which is open A and D2. And then a B power chord, which is first finger A2, third finger on D4. So the first two bars go one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. The next bar, bar number five, we just play an E power chord, last for two, um, for four beats. One, two, three, four. And then there's two beats of rest, and then it um, has a little fade in. So if you've got electric guitar, you can just turn the volume down, hit the, B power chord and then just roll the volume up. So the whole line goes this. Two, three, four. Two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. That takes us to the chorus, which goes like this. So all it's doing is E3. We're doing semi quavers, so 16. So you'll have to use down and up strokes, it'd be really hard to do it all down strokes. I couldn't do it that fast with down strokes, so yeah, down and up strokes going. So down up, 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 down up. And then we go to E5 and we're gonna do eight hits on that. And then eight hits on seven. So slowly the first two bars of that chorus go. speed. Now it does those first two bars three times and then you carry on into bar nine and ten which is exactly the same but it doesn't go up to the seventh fret it just stays on fret five so you just have a bar of E3 and a bar of E5 so you get. So that's like the first line of the chorus. And then on to the next line, and we get this cool riff, which goes. So to play that, open E string, and then down to D string, and we're gonna play it five times. Then D4, A7, A5. So the first bar, slowly. Bit faster. And then you're gonna play in the next bar, E5, and then jump down to G6, and plays that five times to get. I'm going down, up, down, up, down. So from the five, we go. 
Bøf hoster. Bøf hoster. Up to speed. And then does a similar idea going from E7 down to G7. So slowly bar 12 goes. Up speed. So the whole line slowly goes. Up speed. And that repeats around four times, and then it just jumps back to the verse part, the bridge, chorus, uh, then this part of the chorus, and it just keeps repeating that till the end of the song. Well, I do hope you've enjoyed that little guitar lesson. If you have, if you wouldn't mind subscribing to my channel, which is Andy Hillier, give me a like on the video, press the notifications, and I'd love to hear from you, so please leave me some comments in the comment section. Let me know where in the world you're from, what you thought of the video, what you think of this new song, and more importantly, what songs I should do next. And if you love what I'm doing, you want to support me, support the channel, and you want to print the tabs off for this, then I'll put them on my Patreon page. I'll leave a link to that in the description. Well, thanks for watching this. I do appreciate it. I've been Andy Hillier, and I'll see you next time. Thank you.